Hello, bonjour, everybody. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a long, long episode. Oh, boy. And I'm going to rant. I don't care anymore. I know people say I go too long. I talk too much. I'm going to have to rant on this this, this game. I, I, oh, it gives me a headache. Oh, man. It hurts right in the brain. You know what I mean? Uh, start off... I'm going to start to start off with the first period. I'm going to go a little bit, and then I'm just going to rant because I'm holding in my rage right now. I really am. I'm holding in my rage. Um, first of all, first period, we start off horrible. I mean, what else is new? Darnell Nurse scores. Then you've got... Um, then, it, then um, I mean, does it really matter who scores the second goal? Uh, boom, 2 nothing within 10 minutes. We're not getting any shots for some reason. Uh, we can't get it over his own. Um, Sens can't make a pass, like a simple pass, out of your zone. I know people, a lot of people say, well, geez, uh, oh, you know, they're young. They're still learning. But they're, they're, still on a, they're still players. They're still hockey players. These guys are still know how to pass a puck, right? Am I crazy here? Am I, like, absolutely nuts for thinking that they can make a simple pass? Make a pass. Like, take the tape to tape. And I'm really sorry. I'm getting really really sick of Shabbat. I'm getting sick of him. What is going on with him? Why didn't anybody address this problem with him? He he stinks right now. He absolutely stinks right now. He can't do anything. And without Shabbat, we've got nothing zero on defense right now. At least somebody that can actually do something with the puck and get it out of our zone. How this happens, considering in the first period... At the end of the first period, okay, I'm not even going to go through all the other goals because it's 4 nothing after the first. We have, count them, three shots on net. Edmonton has four goals. We have three shots on the net. Meaning that if the net was empty, we'd still be losing. This, it's, it's unbelievable. I get we're not a very good team. That make okay, fine, yes, we're rebuilding, blah blah. You want to talk about that? But how is it that we can't even take a shot on net? Three shots on net after the first period. It's 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 unbelievable. It's unreal. How could a team like how can this be a team that can learn from this? What are you gonna learn about taking not taking shots on net, not getting it out of your zone for once in a while? And you know, you go to the second period. Drysaddle scores again. It's five nothing. We're, we're and at this point, at this point in the game, I don't, I don't remember a single, even somewhat quality chance that Ottawa's had, and it's already five nothing. I'm pretty sure I, I'm pretty sure I saw Smith reading the newspaper at one point, um, and just kind of you know how you just kind of lift it up like, is it what's going? Oh, they're still on their end. Okay, all right, I'll just keep reading the newspaper here. And, oh wait, no! Oh, oh, my coffee's here. Oh, good. You know, I had a little coffee um, because what he must have been bored. I good thing he didn't have. Maybe he had his phone out at one point, and you know, he was checking his email. Oh, what's going on in the game? Oh, okay. Anyways, uh, like, should have they kept Murray in or just take him out? You know what? At that point, I thought at first put the cord in, but what's the point? Really, five nothing already. What's the point, anyways? Who cares? I mean, then there's a sixth goal. And you know what? I'd say out of the six so far, once it was 6 nothing. Oh, by the way, at 6 nothing, shot, four shots on net by the time it was 6 nothing, Four shots on net. You mean if the net was open, it would be 6-4 to four for the Oilers. Our, our, we, we can't be this bad. We can't be this bad. A team that we've beaten teams. We've had won games. And we've played very well. How do you go from winning 6-1 to one against Calgary to being this bad? How is that possible as a hockey team? I know people say, well, they're, you know, they're young and they're going to say, wow, we you, know, you get those people that say, well, you know, well, we did well. and Oh, bad, bad, shut up. Come on. We're still a hockey team. We're still an NH supposed to be an NHL hockey team. Four shots on net throughout almost two periods. The hosts of the freaking show were talking about other things just to try to say, like, 
they're probably like sitting there going, oh, hey, uh, you, you, we should talk something good about the Sens because we keep talking about Drysaddle and McDavid. So what should we say about the Sens? I don't know. They have done nothing. This, they're 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 non-existent this game. Uh, prospects. So they just throw up a bunch of prospects. Oh, this guy's going to be good. Well, maybe Sens fans, you left something to look forward to maybe in a couple of years. You know, if Malik doesn't trade him, you know, who knows? Like, oh, no, 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 no. That's, it's, they're throwing us a bone. They're throwing us a bone. And by the time it's 6 nothing, I think pretty much all Sens fan were thinking this. Stop! He's already dead. Back to the game. 6 nothing by the end of the second period, okay? Zilch is going on for the Sens. Zilch, absolutely. There's nothing I can take. I'm, I usually try to take some kind of a positive. Something I can find. But but there's nobody on that team that's doing anything. You're not trying to fight people. You're not trying to... You're not trying to big, get a big hit. You're not trying to... Do something about McDavid just being able to just do whatever he wants. Nothing. Nothing is happening. I don't see any effort in anything trying to change this game. To at least make it respectable. They're just whatever. Who cares? And by the time the third period comes... I know people like to say, well, they had a bit better. And they had the, the announcers. They had a better third period. They scored a goal. Okay, so we didn't get shut out. Yeah, awesome. That's great. And, and of course, Edmonton scored another goal. Drysaddle again. Because apparently every time Drysaddle shoots... It just literally goes right through Murray, and I'm not blaming completely blaming Murray on this game. It was a team effort in sucking bad, but on I don't understand how a team like this can be this bad. How is it this bad? I understand losing. I get it. We're going to lose a lot, but it's at a point where it's horrible. It's frustrating, but it's like I don't see any positives out of this. I, I don't see Murray's letting in goals left, right, and center. Shabbat looks like fucking... Sorry, I shouldn't swear, but sh looks like garbage. He looks terrible right now. And I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is about him. And don't I don't want to hear this. Oh, he still... No. He, he, he loses the puck half the time. Gives it to the other team. Whether it's Edmonton or... Whatever it is. And so you're... Our, it should be one of our best players. Is doing this... How is he? How are they going to learn? How are the younger guys going to learn? They're going to learn to give the puck away, maybe. Mm -hmm. But what do you, what do you guys think? I'm not. You know what? I'm not saying oh trade people or no. I'm not saying any of that. There's nothing like nothing's going to help this team right now. And you know what, DJ Smith. I've never liked him. I'm sorry. I don't think he's a coach that Ottawa needs right now. I'm not, I'm not saying fire him. I'm just saying I don't think he's the right coach right now. I don't. And maybe they'll change it next year. Maybe. Who knows? I mean, they look to... But the problem is, even if they fire him, they're going to hire another coach that has no no experience. So it doesn't really matter. But it's unbelievable how bad they played this game. I don't remember a game them playing th this bad. They, they're falling on the ice. Passing can't... Can't pass. Can't shoot. I mean, how many times, like, even in the third period, Anisimov takes a shot from the slot. I'm pretty sure he hit the top of the of the boards, of the, the, the glass there on the boards. Like, what? Where is that going? What? Like, it's not even a, it's not even a shot. I would call that a dumping, I guess. I don't know. And, I mean, I like Kachuk. Don't get me wrong, he had a bad game as well. He had a point, a time in the uh, he, had, he had a chance in the slot in the third, and he passed it when he had a perfect shot. And what happened to the pass, of course? Or the guy just took it and was like, "Hey, thanks, man. You, know, you could have had a fucking goal there, probably, but whatever." Un unbelievable. I just, I'm a little worked up right now. It's frustrating. I get it was going to be a frustrating season, but I can tell you right now, none, not a single Sens fan, not even a non-Sens fan, would have thought it would have been this. This this could have happened to a team that was supposed to be hard to play against. I can't do the camera thing, but hard to play against? <laughs> yeah. 
really hard to play against. Edmonton looked like they had a really hard time tonight. And don't get me wrong, Edmonton played well. Don't I'm not I'm not saying anything against Edmonton. They played a good game. But the fact of the matter is that we had four shots. Four shots. Think about that. Four shots in almost two periods. I don't care who you're playing. I'm Pee Wee hockey team. You're probably losing that game. It's it's pathetic. It's it's really sad. It's really sad that kind of effort. Sorry. There was there was nothing, and now we lose, potentially lose the Zingle, potentially lose White. Two of the players, well, you know, you know, as you know, guys, I'm not a crazy, I'm not a big White fan, but the Zingle I was liking, he had some kind of effort. I find he was, if you can name a guy, he had one of the, he seemed like he was doing something out there, trying to do something, anyways, and he's hurt. Um, I haven't heard anything on how hurt he is, but that's what that's what it is. But anyways. Anyways, guys, um, what did you guys think of it? What's wrong with them? What's wrong with them right now? I don't know anymore. I don't know. And I'm really sorry. I don't like Murray. I'm going to say it right now. I don't like him. I don't think he's a... He... You can't have... You can't have a game like this. Every game? Yeah, I know he had a couple good games. What? Three weeks ago, he had, he had a string of a decent games? And now he's right back to sucking again. I thought maybe, you know, okay, he got off his legs, he's doing better. No, no. And and there's some goals that were his fault, some goals that weren't this this game. I'm not saying that. But he's gotta stop the ones that are that he can save. The the dry the dry side of the seventh goal. That was I'm sorry, that was savable. I don't care what anybody says. That was savable. Wasn't that crazy of a shot. It was a nice pass by um, McDavid, of course. But I was a saleable shot. Anyway, it doesn't matter. It was seven, six, six, nothing at that point. It doesn't really matter. Um, and our what? Our one, one thing. Dadenoff scored. His. He scored one goal. Well, he scores one goal every ten game. I don't know. I'm frustrated. I don't see any progress right now. I guess I. I I would like like. When they used to rebuild, because we've had it so many times. I always saw some kind of something to take out of the the, the team the games we were playing, right? Either it'd be close, or you could see effort. It just wasn't the talent. But as you guys know, I can't stand it when there's no effort, and I didn't see much effort out there tonight. Again, again, horrible, horrible, horrible game. This is what I have to say. It's frustrating. And right now, I think at this point. I mean, we're not obviously we're not making the playoffs, but just, I would just you know what they should just ride the season out, keep sucking, whatever. Hopefully, we'll get a high draft pick and um, keep keep going. But um, we're not gonna we're not gonna learn we're not gonna learn as a team by losing like this, where it's it's not even funny. It wasn't even I was I was laughing at the end because it was ridiculous how bad we were, but I don't understand how you can play like this as a hockey team. It's pretty pathetic, to be honest. So we play them again Friday night. And... Unless they blow them out again, like, like just, like, opposite. I I mean, what? this is now 6. We're 6. We're 0-6 against Edmonton. It's the same team. Even at least Winnipeg, we got one win out of it. You know? Anyways... That's it for me tonight, guys, uh, as my rant. I'm sorry it's a rant, but it is. And I really hope... Um, I, ho I hope something can change a little bit in the atmosphere uh, for the Sens, because they, they, they need it. They need something to change, because it's really... that You can't have games like this. And it's not... Come on, guys, you know this. It's not like once or twice. This has happened a lot this season. Too much. You're going back to the 94 season there. Come on. Anyways... Thank you for watching, guys. That's my rant. Oh, it's another another one on Friday, and I'm I'm worried. Maybe, hopefully, I'll get surprised, but I am definitely worried. But as always, send till the end, guys. All right, we'll see you later.